Hello everyone and thank you for tuning in to the Revo Ultra video series. Today we will begin by showing you how to properly set up your NVR for internet connectivity. Before we begin, let's go through a brief checklist to ensure a successful setup. Step 1. Make sure your NVR unit is powered on. Step 2. Make sure to connect a monitor to the NVR by either the VGA or HDMI port. Step 3. Make sure that your monitor is receiving power and is displaying video feed from the NVR, which should be showing a Revo logo or video feed, if you have already connected the cameras. Step 4. Make sure you connect the USB mouse or the remote control for easy access to the NVR menu. Step 5. Connect an Ethernet cable from the LAN network port of the NVR box to your router or modem. Please note that the NVR will have an indicator light to let you know if the cable that you are connecting is receiving connectivity. The light will show a yellow and or green color. Now, let's access the menu by taking the mouse cursor and moving it towards the bottom of the screen and selecting the home icon. Or you can also use the right click of the mouse button to select the menu. Next we will select the system icon and then select the network option. At the top of the screen you will select the TCP-IP tab. From there you will go down and select the DHCP option and click apply. Note, if your router does not support DHCP, then you will have to manually assign an IP address to the machine based off of the configuration from the network that is connected to the NVR. Please click on the apply button after your IP information successfully grays out. If port forwarding is required, then please ensure that port 80 is available on your router. Then go back into your NVR menu and select the system icon and then the network icon. You will then select the tab that reads P2P. Enable P2P by placing a check mark in the box to the right of the enable P2P option. Make sure the domain name below reads www.myrevocloud.com. You will then receive a register code which should be 25 characters long. Use this character code to add your device to the cloud. You will also have the option to scan the barcode located near the register code to add the device to your cloud account from your Revo smartphone via the Revo Ultra app. This is in case you do not have a computer available. For more information regarding this step, please check the How to Add an NVR to My Revo Cloud Account video. Once the device is added, your status will now show online. Your cameras will now be accessible to view from your mobile device, web browser, or the desktop software included. As part of your NVR setup, we strongly suggest you create your My Revo Cloud account to give you easier access to your remote devices, such as cell phones, tablets, and computers for remote viewing. To learn how to do that, please check how and why to create a My Revo Cloud account video.